This is the 10th and final in my Voltage Lab 2 walkthrough series. And this, I'm just gonna show you how the sequencer works when you're using it in keyboard mode, not in knob mode. Previously, we've been looking at what you do when you twist these knobs, but you can actually um, send the CV out depending on what you play with the keyboard or using it as a keyboard. So let's just clear what we've got in here. We have uh, edit, clear, and both of them. So we've got nothing in there. Play it. There's nothing there. Okay. So if we come into edit and we come into top row settings, keyboard mode. And this is the same patch as the last video. It's set up the, exactly the same way. This is the red channel controlling um, laboratory oscillator one. That's controlling the dynamics controller via function generator two. And the yellow channel uh, is playing um, oscillator two through Dynamics Controller 2. Okay, and we're playing in keyboard mode. If we play in keyboard mode and we've got the sequencer on, we're not actually recording anything. Whereas if we're in knob mode, as we push the buttons, we set the steps. So it's not broken, it's just because we're in keyboard mode. I'll just demo that very quickly. If we go into knob mode, come back here, we're setting the steps. So come back out of there. Edit top row settings back into keyboard mode. In fact, I'll put the yellow um, channel into into keyboard mode, into knob mode, and then I can almost give myself a click so we know where we are in a play. Now the red channel is in keyboard mode still. Let's do that, record it. So I'm gonna press run now. This will go into, effectively go into record mode. So that's recorded. Oh, let's press stop on there as well. So that's recorded, the notes are played, but not where to hit them. It's actually played it as if it's recorded it from a standard keyboard. So there, where I played them, but not how I played them, if that makes any sense. So they're where I played them in the loop, but not the notes I actually played. So we're now listening to, when it's in keyboard mode, we're listening to the notes I played, not what's on the red knob there. So let's just turn the yellow one off sequencer mode for now. Play the red. Change this. Doesn't change the notes. If you play something wrong, edit clear. Edit clear. Oh, if I play this now, I'm going to record some. Because I'm in run stroke record mode. It's not going to win any Grammys. Showing as a final video because you can play it like you can play any keyboard.